Guys, what's going on? It's your boy DJ TLM. You're watching DJ TLM TV. Time for a quick Q&A video. It is November 1st, and like I've been announcing, and if you haven't seen my announcements, you need to follow me on social media. Um, November is the month. I'm back at it again. I'm a new DJ in a foreign country. I've been traveling and working the last many years. A problem I have is many of the local DJs and promoters are copying and biting my style in terms of how I play music, track selection, dress, and the way I promote and make flyers and advertisements. I know of some things I can do to prevent this, but I wanted another opinion from a longtime DJ like yourself. So you move around a lot, travel a lot, go to new places, and wherever you go, people start to copy, not just the way you play, but also the way you promote yourself. Uh, all right, first off, you must be doing something right, because if you go to new places and they start to copy you, then you're doing it better than the DJs and promoters that are already there. So you can take that as a compliment. Now I know uh, it's not always cool if people start to copy you and it's real easy for me to say take it as a compliment. Um, but if they're copying you and your style, that would still mean that you're better at that style. Because if I watch someone do something and I like what they do and I try to copy and emulate that, I might be able to copy that, but it's gonna take time before I can do it to the same level that they can do it, uh, or I might not even be able to reach that level. I don't know, I would not be too worried about that. I would just try to focus on what you're doing already because you're probably also good at the way you advertise yourself if they're trying to copy that. So make sure that you're the most known with that style um, and how you play and how you look and everything. I mean, you say that you have ways to prevent that, so I don't know, maybe you wanna share that in the comment section, how you try to prevent people from copying you. I could not see how I can stop people from really copying me. I don't see it happening here because a lot of, um, like the most commercial uh, attractive style here right now is not the style that I do. So most of the popular DJs aren't DJing the way that I'm DJing. Uh, and in my opinion, I'm just sticking to my guns and I, firmly believe that things go in circles and it's only a matter of time until people, more people really start to appreciate the way I play and DJs that have a similar style to me. So I continue to do what I do, but even if people wanted to copy me, I don't know, I don't see how I stop that. I mean, if they watch how I mix and they start to emulate my mixes, that's gonna happen. Now to be honest, uh, if we're looking at mixing styles, I believe that a large part of the crowd doesn't really pay too much attention to the technical side of things. So I don't know if you're also talking about the technical side, but that's my experience, that most people are there to dance, um, to drink, to look at guys or girls, and just enjoy tracks, but they're not paying a lot of attention to the technical side. Otherwise, they would see and hear every mistake and a lot of WAG DJs would not get to play uh, the amount of times that they're playing right now. So, I don't know, I don't have any suggestions to keep people from copying your style. I would just say, really try to promote yourself, make sure that you're the one that's really known for that style, and you should be the one that's known for that style because you've been doing that style for longer than all the others. Um, and not really worry about it. So once again, let us know how you're preventing people from copying your style. Let us know in the comment section down below and to all DJs watching, do you have that problem? Are people copying your style of mixing or just your looks or the way you promote yourself? Do you have a problem with that? Or are you doing things to prevent that? Join the conversation in the comment section down below and share the knowledge. I would be very interested to see if a lot of people are dealing with these issues. That's it for this episode. This is November 1st and this is the first video and I will be back tomorrow. Follow me on Periscope, follow me on Instagram and Snapchat to really stay up to date because I will be dropping a lot more behind the scenes footage, extra updates. So if you're only following me on YouTube, 
then the only time you hear me, see me, is when I post a new video, but there's a lot of stuff that goes on in between as well. And if you're new to the channel and this was your first experience with DJ TLM TV, I have a lot more videos on the channel, so make sure you subscribe because there's a lot more new videos on the way as well. I have a lot of playlists where you can find tutorials, reviews, and all that good stuff. If you have any suggestions for new videos or any questions, you can also check me on Snapchat, Instagram, uh, Twitter, Facebook, I'm everywhere, or just email me djtlmtv at djtlm.com. Make sure you like the video, share the video, and I'll be back tomorrow. Peace.